This fight is so important for so many reasons. I'm fighting in my country, I'm fighting the main event, I'm fighting in Maracanãzinho, which is the temple of Jiu-Jitsu. The fans can go there and, you know, expect for a good fight. The crowd in Rio de Janeiro, they are great. I fought there before and it's an amazing feeling. I just want to go there and feel that again. Ryan Lafleur is a pretty tough opponent. I saw his fights and there is no holes in his game at all. So I know that's going to be a war. He has a good stand-up, you know, a good kicks, good hands, good wrestling. But you know, I'm a good wrestler too. I've been training wrestling for a long time now. I've been doing camps in the United States, in Brazil. Physically, he's, you know, big for the weight division. Uh, he never lost. He's 11 and 0. In one point of my career, I was also 11 and 0. It's all over. That's how good Damian Maia is. I fought many guys like Ryan that want to pass through me to get a ticket to the next level, and I I beat those guys. It's great that Lafleur thinks he can do well on the ground when we fight him because that's my game, and if he wanna fight on my game, that will be great. That is top of the food chain Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu right there. I'm gonna beat Ryan Lafleur because I need to prove to myself that I'm still a top athlete in my division. I think I'm more dangerous than him because I have more experience. I've been competing for a longer time. I've been in the UFC for almost eight years. I don't want Ryan Lafleur to ruin my home come to Brazil. My biggest will in the fight night is to make my people very proud. I have all the respect for Ryan Lafleur. I know he's a great athlete, but I will have my hand raised because I want to be champion of the world, and Ryan is not going to ruin that.